We're trying to create something by fans, for fans, where, where people know what they're getting. Amazing, isn't it? The Toronto After Dark Film Festival starts next weekend at the Bloor Cinema. Program director Todd Brown dropped by our hyperspace studio this past week, and I chatted with him about the festival lineup. Now you know how it feels. So tell me about the Toronto After Dark Film Festival. Yeah, it's a uh, new genre film festival that starts uh, this year in October, runs October 20th through 24th. Uh, we have 13 films from a range of genres. It's a little bit horror focused this year, but we have a lot of stuff that kind of combines a lot of genres. We don't want you coming any closer, hey, hey, okay? Hey. When she gets hungry, she has the strength of 10 men. She's like a mythical beast. Try to play nice, and we've done nothing but get kicked in our asses. The core of us, we're all just, we're film fans. Uh, we love this kind of stuff, and other than Midnight Madness at, at the Toronto Film Festival, these international films just don't get seen. Uh, most of them don't even get DVD releases. And there's a lot of them from around the world uh, that come out that are really, really good stuff. And Toronto is such a great film city. We, we all just found it really strange that this doesn't happen here. I mean, I, I programmed for Fantasia in Montreal this year, uh, and Montreal is really supportive of it. It's a great festival, and it just seems really odd that a city the size of Toronto that has as many film fans as Toronto does um, that has so much happening culturally didn't have something like this. And we figured if it could work anywhere, uh, it should be able to work here. Good job, honey. And doing it, doing it before Halloween was just an obvious choice. I mean, if you're going to do something horror-oriented and, and there was an open week there at, at the Blue Cinema where we're doing it, uh, you can't not put it in front of Halloween. You have no idea how much cardio I have to do. Why so much? There's that whole thing of making it look like you're walking. And everybody else is running their asses off. <laughs> They're fun movies. Um, they're a good time, and they're best experienced on the big screen. And our, our goal is to, to create uh, something equivalent to a Brussels or a Sickies, to, to build it up over the years. We're starting relatively small this year, but we're already lining up titles for next year. We're already talking to films and producers and, and getting the name out there. And hopefully, it seems like it's starting to change a little bit, the, the market here. Hey, We're building something. I mean, we're fans of the genre, and so we're trying to create something by fans, for fans, where, where people know what they're getting, um, and it's catering to them. We would like to create a North American equivalent of the EFFF and, and really get something set up here where these films can get out and get seen and, and find the audiences that, that they deserve to have. These really worked? Our results have been remarkably promising. Bless. Okay. Explain to my retarded sibling here. Just because something is a force field, right, doesn't mean it has to be invisible. Listen, I have to tell you guys something. No! I have superpowers. Amazing, isn't it? Quite unusual. Are you hurt? No, no, I never felt better. Why? For more details on the festival, just log on to the website below.